located in Tampa, is Burns, one of the most well-known and respected steakhouses in the country. Burns is also known for having the largest private collection of wine in the world. Hi, Emerald. How are you? Great. Welcome to Burns. Oh, delighted to be back. David Laxer is the owner of Burns and the son of its founders. Burns traces its roots back to the early 1950s, when Byrne and Gert Laxer bought a small luncheonette in Tampa. They moved to the current location in 1956, and since then, it's become one of the most highly regarded restaurants in the country, not only for its steaks, but also for its wine list, which at one time was as thick as a Manhattan phone book. You know, my father had tremendous passion for a lot of different things, and uh, he wanted to create a place that you could have pretty much any wine you wanted to have, either by the glass or on the list, um, paired with great food. David mentioned wines by the glass. Well, at Burns, you've got a lot of them to choose from. So how many wines by the glass you have? Well, probably around 200 wines by the glass, <laughs> so yeah. Most wine lists. Yeah. <laughs> My father started buying early when, when people weren't buying wines, and he was able to buy at, at ridiculously slow prices, but he bought in such huge quantities. Today, Burns has over 600,000 bottles of wine in its inventory. We got a tour of the warehouse where about 500,000 of those bottles are kept. And this place is wild. Wines from all over the world and from all different vintages. And if that's not enough wine, there's another 100,000 bottles in the restaurant's wine cellar. Eric Reno is the senior sommelier at Burns. 100,000 bottles here. Yeah, exactly. Minimal. Exactly. Burn put something together so that anybody could come and just enjoy a great bottle of wine at any cost. I mean, there's stuff in here that's 30 years old and $30 that drinks beautifully. And every now and then, they come across some hidden gems on the shelves of the wine cellar. I was putting a bottle away, it was on a shelf, and I'm sliding the bottles back. I was like, that tink. And I reach back in, I, and I look at this bottle, and it was like, holy crap. Right. It's 1947 Chateau Latour. Three liter. Three liter, which they don't exist. Now, whether you go for the 30000 or $30 bottle, there are some great steaks that you can pair it with at one of the top restaurants in the country. When you come to Tampa, check it out.